I'm here to show you the top five things to look for when booking a seasonal rental. Number one, first and foremost, know the building that you're looking for. Do your research first. There's a ton of different condo buildings in whatever part of the world you may be looking at. Check out the buildings, do some research on the buildings and what they offer so you can start from a good place. Number two, if possible, try to get a copy of the floor plan. Okay, if you work with me and we're here in Miami, I can get those for you. But having a copy of the floor plan can definitely make the difference of getting the right view or getting the right layout and getting it completely wrong and having a terrible rental. Number three, pay close attention to the online photos, to the furniture. Okay, you're gonna wanna look at the quality of the furniture. Just pay attention to it. See, is it cheap furniture? Does it look good? Is it scratched? Is it mismatched? Mismatched or scratched up, dinged up, bad looking furniture is a telltale sign that you're probably dealing with an owner that you don't wanna deal with. And it's also a telltale sign that you may be walking into a rental that when you get there on the day of moving is not gonna be something that you're gonna be happy with. Number four, have your broker or agent send you updated pictures recently taken before you move in. The pictures online that you looked at might have been good, but they may have changed things, messed things up, added things. Have your broker do a once around and send you some updated photos prior to you signing anything or moving in. Number five, watch out for a deal that's too good to be true, especially if it's in the luxury market. You're not gonna get a $10,000 rental for 5,000. If you do, there's clearly something wrong with it, and it's a risk that, in my opinion, is not worth taking. So watch out for those deals that sound too good to be true. Pay a fair price, work with a good agent, and you'll be fine, you'll be good to go. But take care of those five things, and you'll be all set.